two games since you've been here. How are you enjoying your time so far? Uh, yeah, it's, it's been good so far. Uh, I think I'm fitting in well with the guys. Um, I think I still need a bit of time to adjust to the physicality of the league and these things, but I think I am, you know, with my with my uh, my strengths and my abilities, I, I can I can adjust quickly. Has it been more physical than you expected so far, or is it, has it been? Uh, it yeah, it's been a bit more physical. Uh, I didn't expect it to be so, you know, strong in the tackles, these things. But yeah, I think I, I've adjusted well to it, for sure. It's, uh, it's been two tough games though so far. You're hoping that you can get your first victory in the cup this weekend. Yeah, for sure. Uh, we, you know, this will help the 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 team to to come up a bit in the mentality and the you know, and uh, I think yeah, of course it'll help us a lot going into the league next. After it will help. Just for all the fans, Motherwell fans out there. But, what, what could you say to them? What can you offer this team that perhaps the team doesn't have at the moment? Um, no, we just we need to to put our our back against the wall, you know, and 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 go and do it, you know, in the in the final third, in the in the defensive plays, to to do those those things that are going to make the difference, you know, whether it's finishing, whether it's uh, blocking the shot, whatever it is, you know, this is what we we have to to fix, you know, and, and aim to do, you know. Quite a, a well traveled commute so far. Why was Mullow the, the latest place you wanted to go? Sorry. Why was Why was Mullow the latest place you wanted to go? You've obviously been. Uh, around with it. Yeah, no, I, it was. I felt like it was a good move for me, you know, to to come in and uh, to come in and help and make a difference in the team, you know. Um, you know, when I was uh, playing in Europe and these things, you know, I, I want to go around and learn all the all the systems, how how the leagues are playing, the physicality of the league, the all these things, yeah, so I was happy to come here, yeah. Is there a nation you've been to that's sort of most similar to Scotland in your early experience? Uh, actually, Belgium was uh, was very similar. The physicality of the play, the yeah, the tackles, the the speed of the game, like these, it's similar. Kind of different as well from college football, I can imagine. Yeah, so I actually didn't go to college football. I came directly into, into Europe when I was 17 or 18, so I didn't, I didn't experience the, the college level, yeah. Yeah, for sure. It was <laughs> difficult, you know, had his difficulties, but, you know, I think this is what makes you stronger as a person, grows your faith. It, it allows you to, you know, grow into the person you want to be, you know. Well, how is the mood in the dressing room at the moment? Because obviously things aren't been going the way the manager would have wanted in recent weeks. Uh, we're not in, we're not really in a, in a disaster kind of mindset, but we are, we are awake and we're aware of the situation. We really want to make a difference. We spoke about it yesterday that you know we really need to to put our heads up and, and and do the job. You know, whether it's in the final third, whether it's like I said, blocking the final shot, making the difference, and that's really the the mood in the in the dressing room right now. In your early readings of this squad, is this a squad that when the chips are down, do you think that they can battle back and rally together and win the backs of the game? For sure, forward? for yeah. sure, I feel like this. Yeah, I think we showed it time and time again. For sure, and I'm, I, you know, I'm new here, but I, I think the guys, they're really good guys, and I think that they, when our backs are against the wall, we will come out of it, for sure. How is life in Scotland? How are you adjusted to the city in the... Oh, uh, yeah, it's, it's good so far. I'm still in the hotel. Uh, I'm waiting on my apartment, so I haven't really experienced it so much, but yeah, I'm enjoying it so far. So you mentioned, obviously, you were young when you moved to Europe. Was that quite tough as, you know, teenager to adjust? Yeah. There were some tough times that you've come through. For sure. It's... Uh, you know, I uh, had a, a few trials that I went to in different countries and it was really, really difficult. It was, to be honest for me, it was one of the most difficult times of my life was traveling, you know, those long, very long flights on my own, leaving my family. It was, it was quite difficult and it was always the most difficult on the, on the first night because it, basically you're with your, fr your, your family, your friends, and then you're, you're alone and uh, you're in a different, completely different atmosphere, new people, new languages, you know. You don't understand all the people, so this was really the most difficult. Well, what made you do that then when you were that age? Oh, I think, you know, I'm a, a strong believer in God. It was really my faith that, you know, my faith, my dream to, to do these things, to go and try and not be afraid of the, of the challenges there, of the uncertainties there. It was really... And obviously you, you're certainly not going to see you're in a hotel now, but you've, you've been used to that, I take it. In hotels and yeah, for sure, and all over the place. You know, always hotels, especially when you're on trial. You, you're in the hotels. Yeah, it's it's a part of the of the life, I think, for a football player. You know. 
and you think having travelled a bit that's helped your football as, as well as you? Yeah, for yeah. sure. I think I'm, you know, opened. I'm, you know, an open book. I've seen the different styles of play, the different players. I've adjusted to the the languages, the the, the atmosphere in the dressing room, all these things for sure. Obviously, have you had any good experiences in cup competitions uh, in your career? Um, I would say in Greece. Um, we were playing, uh, I was in second division there, but we were beating the, the first division clubs there and we went into the semi-final of the cup there. So it was a good a good uh, move for us that, that year. Uh, we played against uh, Ofi, Ofi Crete there, and uh, Adi, uh, Aris, and we beat them. Yeah, we beat them both, and we made it into the, the next round, yeah. So you obviously know, you talk about the, the run model we're on, but a, a cup win would, would be a huge Yeah, thing. of course. be a really big thing for us, yeah.